Hey everyone, hey folks, this is Looney Tunes 9000. Um, this video, I really have some very sad news to tell you about another YouTube account being deleted, automatically deleted by YouTube. This time, once again, by copyright infringement. Um, it's our very good friend. Previous guy return. I heard about this this morning. Um, from local li from my good friend, local library incorporated, and I and I thank local library incorporated for for telling me this shocking news about. The automatic deletion of the previous guy returned due to copyright infringement by fucking YouTube due to their fucking cash cow ways. <sighs> I mean, Jesus, they're a fucking big cash cow, and they've been like this ever since to, uh, Google bought them in what, 2006 or 2007? I mean, goddamn. And let me read you what Local Library Incorporated posted 12 hours ago on his feed portion of his channel. It says this, and I quote, I think the previous guy returns account is gone. And he's right. It is gone due to copyright, multiple copyright, third party copyright infringement. Five minutes. From these following big movie studios, including Paramount Pictures Corporation and two copyright infringement problems with Warner Brothers Pictures and Warner Brothers Entertainment, Warner Brothers Entertainment, or what otherwise known as Warner Brothers Pictures and Incorporated. Now, nobody knows whoever was behind the previous guy returns, so I don't even know who was behind the previous guy returns. So whoever was behind the previous guy returns account on YouTube, I feel very sorry for you. You're always welcome to come back with a new account. And here's a tip: don't don't try to upload previews from Paramount. Warner Brothers. Warner Brothers do ignore that. It's just they're my brothers are just idiots making fucking noise they don't need to fucking make. Okay, so as I was saying to the previous Sky Returns who is profile is now deleted um if you come back with a new account, don't try to upload previews from Paramount because of their parent company, Viacom, this big fucking baby, on uh, people sharing their con content, you know, from Paramount, Nick, Junior, T Nick, and all their other brands. Well, you can't do this. You can't upload this on the internet. Well, that's our content. You can't steal it. You'll be put in jail. That's ours. We just make money for it. You don't need to put it on the internet. Make your own content. Well, we're Viacom. We're just a big ass company that makes money. Well, Viacom, just shut the fuck up. And you're gonna have to learn. You need to stop protecting your copyrighted content from your from your brands and uh, learn that people want to put this stuff on the internet and say we don't own, own this stuff. It's uh, owned by Paramount Pictures, or we have a Viacom, or owned by Nick and slash MTB Networks, or we have a Viacom. 
or any other Viacom brand. Just shut the. All I'm saying to you, Viacom, is shut the fuck up. And just let people upload uh, copyrighted content, and and then they can put, we don't own this stuff. Whatever your brand, whatever your brand, on behalf of, own it is owned by, whatever, mm, whichever one of Viacom's brands on behalf of Viacom. Which means that, which can tell that people don't own the Viacom, own, one of Viacom's content. In respectful ways, so they don't go into fucking jail. <sighs> well, ignore that. Alright. Now back to what I was saying to, now, former count, now dead account, previous guy returned, to whoever was behind it. One more tip for you. If you come back, like I said, do not upload previews on Paramount, whether it's VHS or DVD. I don't care, just don't upload it. Viacom's gonna be a baby and try to say, Oh, you don't own it. You don't need to put it on the internet. And then there comes Warner Brothers. But they're not gonna be babies, they're gonna be pissed. So like I, so like I said, you got yourself in trouble, and you got yourself in trouble with the copyright police, with multiple copyright infringement, um, multiple reports by Paramount, and two by Warner Brothers, one by Paramount, and then one by uh, two by Warner Brothers. And that's how you got your pro. Uh, that's how you got pre your pro uh, previous guy returned deleted. So that's how. That's why my. That's why I'm giving you that advice. Uh, whoever was behind the previous guy returns, if you're watching this. So. And um, so yeah. And if you do come back, um, let me give you one thing. The only safe copyrighted content that you can upload is Disney. Disney will care because they don't like to delete that content. Because Disney, you know, Disney's not really meant for kids. But you could say copyright by Disney. We don't own this stuff. Um, I don't own it. Uh, we don't own it. Uh, Disney owns it. Um, Disney owns this content. I don't own it. Yada, yada, fucking yada. End of story, period. Um, you are also told not to upload stuff on 20th Century Fox. But then there's the last bit of last side of resort, MGM. Um, but do try MGM previous VHS DVD. Just say copyright by MGM, and then maybe Columbia too. Just say copyright Columbia, and say I don't own this stuff. Columbia owns this. So on behalf of Sony. And then just say copyright MGM Holdings Incorporated. I don't own this stuff. And MGM Holdings Incorporated LLC owns this stuff. It's VHS or whatever, DVD, whatever. Again, this is a message to the guy whoever whoever was behind the previous guy returned. So this is just advice to him. Um. And then try a little bit of dumb. And then the last resort, the way, the way last resort is try public domain VHSs or DVDs. Whether it's animated cartoons in the public domain or animated or live action movies. Or uh, live action television shows in the public domain. Which they're copyrighted. Their copyrights have expired years ago. 
some some years ago or decades ago. Where you're free to do that, so there won't be any copyright infringements on that. So yeah, you that's the most safest copyright free content to upload, so yeah. Because those that stuff is public domain. That stuff means the that their copyright content that without copyright is ex that means the copy with a content without a copyright means that a copyright it has expired years ago so that's a message to the guy who was behind the previous guy returns if he ever comes back on YouTube so uh, yeah so, uh, in memory of the previous guy returns on YouTube, he was only on YouTube for a short time, for a short couple of years, 2010 to 2012. Previous guy returned, will miss you. So, this is Looney Tunes 9000. I'm signing off. Previous guy, previous guy returned. You count previous guy return. You deserve to be in YouTube heaven. Didn't need to suffer from evil YouTube.